Alright guys, welcome back to some more Fallout 4. Um, I went and did a little bit of scavenging. And I got an upgraded... I didn't hit that. I got an upgraded... Um, oh well, you guys kind of saw it there. The rifle. Got an upgraded barrel on it. I talked... Went back here. I talked to him. I talked to the weird drug lady and gave her some drugs, and she said, "Someone with a bright heart I need to find in Diamond City, whatever." I also talked to the black guy that runs this place, and he gave me a flare gun and a f some flares. Apparently, if I shoot that up when I'm near a settlement. The Minutemen will come and help me. The Minutemen. Now he was telling me about some quests, but I didn't want to get too far ahead without being on camera, so I'm trying to find him now. So we can do that real quick. He was just in the middle of telling me a story and I walked away. I'm like, alright, this is getting too far. You don't mind making a chair. Oh, you want a chair? I'll get you a chair right now. There you go. How's that? Now where did he go? I hope you find your son. Sir. What's up? Codsworth. Sir, welcome back, sir. I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Concord. You could say that. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but if needed, I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. Um. We'll awkwardly walk away. I don't really want a companion. I don't really even want the dog to be honest. I mean it's cool but it's more of a challenge to play by yourself. Now where is this guy? It's so stinking foggy. Here he is. Okay. There's something I need to ask you. I don't think I ever told you what happened to the Minuteman. How I ended up as the last one. You're the last one? Are you really the last Minuteman? Maybe not literally. There must be a lot of former Minutemen out there who gave it up in disgust after the Quincy Massacre. But we were the last active group of Minutemen. And now, well, it's just me. What happened? What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. No. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead, so I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord? As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up, but I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. That means a lot coming from you, Garvey. I appreciate that. Does that mean you'll do it? Uh, yeah. Okay. I'll do it. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Miniman. And the Commonwealth, too. Don't worry. I'll be right beside you all the way. General. That's quite a promotion you just gave me. 
The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of general. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last Minuteman is, there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. <laughs> now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. I've gotten word about a settlement that's being threatened by raiders. Let's do it. I'll mark it on your map. Oh. I'll find out what they need. We could use more settlements supporting our cause. Let's do it. Woo Alright guys, we're gonna go help out this settlement. Splash, splash, okay. Can't wait to try out the new gun. Oh man, I need to sell some junk. I'm at 230 pounds. Um, what am I wearing? Drifter outfit. This is five damage resistance, seven electrical. What is this? Six and four just on that. I don't have anything in my right leg though. Or anything underneath the armor. Okay. Look at Minutemen outfit. Cool. We're gonna try to find a right leg as soon as possible. Okay, that's fine. Now, this is my place as well. Hopefully we can store stuff in here. I think we can. Yeah, that's empty. Let me just make sure everything looks empty around here. Yeah, that was still open. Can't believe I didn't take that toaster before. Radax caps? What? What have I been doing? Okay. So, let's build a chest somewhere secure. Furniture container. Where's miscellaneous? That's um. Oh, we can actually run a TV. Um, we're gonna put it some kind of container. Foot locker. Actually, a safe would be cool, and we can hide it underneath these tires. Um, let's see. Move. This is cool. Okay. Ah, stupid dog, get out of the way. And right in that corner right there. Built. No. Put the stinking safe down. Exit. Okay. 
Okay, so we're gonna put all this extra junk in there. Weapons we don't need. Twenty seven pounds, we'll get rid of that. I don't not gonna use that for a while. Okay. Now, I don't know how easily this can be like robbed or anything, but we're going to put this here just in case. I can still access it, okay. Move out of the stinking way! Alright, we're gonna go check out this settlement here. Oh no, they killed the Brahmin. Quick save real quick. This car is so cool, I would totally drive one of these. I like how the thing is just a bubble roof. Can this be open? No, it cannot. I'm kind of disappointed that there's so many buildings that can't be open. Maybe we can go in and just take the toasters and all the, the useless junk. But oh well, such is life. It's still a great game. Take that real quick. That's the quarry. Okay, so I'm kind of getting familiar with my surroundings here. And I use my, I gotta level up to I use the perk point on making non-automatic weapons 20% more powerful. Okay, here's a part where I'm going to have to load this. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Oh, crud. Let's test out the new weapon. Guys, ready? <laughs> Dropped him. Yeah, boy. Okay, so that's becoming a lot more powerful. Oh, we got one right there. And one right there. Let's see. Ah, oh, crud.
There was one on the other side of the train. Where did he go? I got free. Try. That guy is standing up to me like, what are you gonna do? I guess when I shot, the sparks was enough to trigger that flame right there. I need to be a lot more careful of that. I like that they added a uh, melee system in here, so you can actually hit stuff. Oops, we're all safe. I'm gonna take the fire extinguisher. I don't know what you get from that yet. Let's go explore this house over here. Usually in Fallout games, railroads mean death claws, but apparently not in this game, so that's good. Death claw would probably one or two shot me without that power armor. Whoa. Whoa, it's a little. Ugh. Whoa, mole rat. There's gotta be something good in here. Whoa. I'm taking the meat. Let's see if we can take it over there. Oh crud. Yeah, just take him down. Oh my goodness! What happened there?
good grief, guys. That was crazy. Whoa. That was worth it, just that right there. That was it, but hey, that was definitely worth it. What do we got in here? Ladder. Coke. Nope. First aid. We'll take it. Desk, bottle caps. Money. Cool. Now onward we march to that settlement. See that's the thing with Fallout. That's why I don't skip it, because you run into buildings like that. All those mole rats busting out of nowhere was crazy. Cause it was like one at a time, and I was just getting bored with it. Yeah, this game is fun. Only thing though is the grass doesn't really load in. Oh, let me pause it. Like I'm in the exact same area where I just paused it. Sometimes it doesn't load in very well. Some kind of health thing? Looks like maybe a hospital? Let's go to the, get the first aid on the bus. Oh, it says I have it. A sweater vest and slacks. How much further is the settlement? Oh my goodness. We've got quite a ways to go. Huh. Oh, rat scorpion. Oh, they look nasty now. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. Legendary rat scorpion. Ah, oh, I'm not going to be able to touch it. Okay. Run. Oh, crud. Go, 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 go. Jump the vents, jump the vents. Whoa. What? Oh, it's alive. Ah, I'm back. Oh, man, guys, that was scary. What in the world? Usually they're really bad. In the old games, you had to have, like, in-game level rifles to hit a sniper or an anti-material rifle. Man, that was hard. I got a good, like, five shots on it and it barely touched it. I'm not going to go through 200 bullets just to kill one of those. Looks like Iron Man. Aw, oh, quick saved here? Good grief. And a sentry bot. Okay, this is not meant to be. I'm running. Do you not have any compassion? Oh, 
crud, guys. Let me load it. Okay, still running, still running. Um, some kind of community here. Help me, please. Please. They, uh, this place is stacked. Covenant. Howdy. Are you Covenant, pal? If not, move along. You know, I'm people loitering around. Not good for the nerves. Hey. I'd like to visit. Since you're a first timer, there's something you gotta know first. What? We don't just let anyone inside. There's an entrance test. We call it the safe test. Everyone's gotta take it. Interesting idea. Between you and me, what's the test for? I probably shouldn't say nothing, but listen. We want to make sure only good people come into Covenant. No undesirables. Nobody that ain't actually what they seem, you know? Yeah. I'm new to the area. What do you mean about undesirables? You know what? Don't worry. Safe is one of them psychological tests. Just a bunch of questions you gotta answer. You wanna take the test? Pass it, and I'll let you in. Okay. Sure. Good. Take a seat, and we can begin. <sighs> All right. I believe you meant that chair. Okay. So let's begin. There ain't no wrong answers. I... You are approached by a frenzied scientist who yells, I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. What's your response? Um, cover my butt. I wouldn't worry. If he did that, it'd cause parabolic destabilization of the fission singularity. Uh, yeah. Next question. While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection on his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading at an alarming rate. The doctor has stepped out for a while. What do you do? Amputate. Easily we amputate it. Amputate the foot before the infection spreads? Hmm, amputation. Next question. You discover a young boy lost in a cave. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears to be in possession of stolen property. What do you do? This case, it is a young boy, so we need to comfort him. I give the boy a hug and tell him everything will be okay. Very curious. Congratulations! Hey, you made it onto a baseball team. Which position do you prefer? In the baseball team? I would prefer to play the soccer position. Um. I'd say pitcher. Are you certain about that? Never mind. Next question. Your grandmother invites you to tea, but you're surprised when she gives you a pistol and orders you to kill someone. What do you do? <laughs> Minigun, I... But I bargain for his life. I think I'd honestly... I'd be like, why, I'd Grandma? i whatever she wants to spare his life. Mm. Typical Class B. Old Mr. Abernathy has locked himself in his quarters again. And you've been ordered to get him out. How do you proceed? In his quarters? Okay. I would procure a bomb. I would easily pick Grab the lock. Grab a bobby pin and pick the lock. I'm and a good lock pick. That's all you do? Nothing else? Wait, don't answer. Next. Oh, no. <laughs> you've been exposed to radiation, and a mutated hand has grown out of your stomach. What's the best course of treatment? Okay, um, at that point, we would have to do surgery. I'd cut off the mutated tissue with a precision laser. Technological bias. Hmm. A neighbor is in possession of a Grognak the Barbarian comic book, issue number one. You want it. What's the best way to obtain it? <laughs> Slip him a Mickey. <laughs> That's easily the best way to do it. Slip some knockout drops in his Nuka Cola, <laughs> then take it. Hmm. You're almost done. <laughs> Slip him a Mickey. Last question. You decide it would be fun to play a prank on your father. You enter his private restroom when no one is looking, and 
Razor. Sabotage toilet. Changes meds. I'd put a firecracker in his toilet. <laughs> that never gets old. Test's over. No one's ever answered quite like you. But hey, <laughs> you passed. I'll open up the gate. Razor blade the toilet seat. Cool. So we're gonna head into Concord here. I know this isn't the right settlement, but we're gonna wait. Welcome is to this Con the right settlement? Cover Covenant, not Concord. Dude, look at their they are stacked. Alright. This is it? Caravan came a few days back. Worked for old man Stockton. You saw him, right? Alright, this is it guys. Well, I thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye bye.